Hey everybody, welcome to the Delivery Driver Pit Stop. My name is Michael, I am your host. Maybe I should uh, change my name from Michael to like Big Daddy Wags. Hmm. Big Daddy Wags, Michael. Anyway, I hope everybody is having a great weekend out there. I decided to uh, uh, take a couple week break from posting videos so you guys uh, had a break from this hunk of a burning love face here. Uh, anyway, um, I received a uh, email a, a couple days ago uh, of someone sharing a screenshot that kind of not only made me laugh, but kind of shook my head and said, uh, wow. So uh, I'll show you the screenshot here. Um, it's a screenshot for a Mexican restaurant for uh, $9.99. Not too bad, as long as it's not too far. But let me... Uh, let me uh, magnify uh, where the drop off is going uh, is at, and uh, once you see the drop off, uh, how many of you would uh, say, "Oh hell no"? I mean, come on, man. Yeah, exactly, Joe Biden. Yeah, uh, come on, man. I would not. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm gonna have man. to take a pass on this one, brother. Uh, I would not be wanting to uh, deliver to a COVID testing facility, uh, no matter if it was $9.99 or $29.99 or $39.99. I mean, what are you going to go wrapped in a, I would go wrapped in a full body suit or hazmat suit just to drop the food off. I realize uh, people at these places have to eat, but perhaps they can take a little break and go out and get the food themselves rather than uh, having a, a DoorDash driver or a Grubhub driver drop off the food to them. Let me ask you, uh, once you see where the food is being dropped off, would you, yes, you, deliver Mexican food? It doesn't matter what kind of food it is, but for uh, discussion sakes, would you deliver this food to this place for $9.99? $9.99. I would not. Sorry, I would have to give this one a pass, bro. As that famous saying, come on, give this one a bra brass. Give this one a brass. Give this one a pass. Um, curious what you guys think about it. Would you do this? Um, leave a comment in the comment section below and tell me if you would uh, deliver to a COVID-19 testing site for under 10 bucks. I would not. I am dying to see, not dying, literally, I'm really anxious to see what kind of responses I would I'm going to get in the comment section below so leave a comment in the comment section below uh, if you as always it's going to be a short sweet video if you appreciate videos such as that a little bit such as this if you would leave one of these all right would you shut up man? Man. all right all right I'll, I'll get to it god these these moody politicians I tell you uh, leave one of these also, if you'd be so kind to follow me on uh, social media, I'm on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook, the three devils of social media. Um, also, uh, uh, a couple weeks ago, I silently, I didn't say nothing, but maybe a week, week and a half ago, uh, the Delivery Driver Pit Stop celebrated its two-year anniversary. So, yay us. Um Hopefully, uh, I will see you in another year, and I'll have uh, uh, the channel will be bigger. Uh, the, the month of January has done well. We've been doing well the month of January with the views, and we got lots of new subs and lots of new people. Hi, everybody out there. It's new. Anyways, I think that's it. Have a great rest of the weekend. Speak up. Let me know what you think about this interesting uh, drop-off location, and uh, I think that's about it. We will see you. Oh, hang in there. Lights at the end of the tunnel. Make sure you wear your mask. Make sure you social distance. Keep everybody safe. And we will get through this together. God bless you. God bless your family. We will see you next time on the Delivery Driver Pit Stop, everybody. This is Big Daddy Wags signing off. It's Michael. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye, everybody. Take care.